Press and Lons lined up against each other for the second time in a matter of weeks after Bress fell to a 3-1 defeat against Franck Ezes, Racing in the Coupe de France. The Stade François Leblay faithful at full volume, especially after the Pirates produced their best scoreline of the season in their more recent home outing, demolishing Angers 4-0. Lons, a completely different proposition. Marco Bizot knew he'd have to be alert. Diver Machado with the chance. The Colombian would be sorely hurt in the second half. He may miss a few matches just after signing a new contract. Bizot certainly was busy and certainly alert. Alert to the danger posed by Luis Openda. At the break, goalless, and it's not been going Lon's way of late. A draw, and then a defeat by Nice at home, had left them shaken, but then it was Le Blay that was stirred. Jeremy Le Duaron. Perfectly placed to make it two goals in two home games. What a pick out by Pierre Les Melou. Lons looked for a response. And they almost got one from one of their latest signings. Julien Le Cardinal through the crowd. Took a sore one. And making his first top flight start since his move from Ligue 2 Becquete Bastia. Brilliant ball from former Bordeaux man for Steve Meunier. The striker couldn't put it away after being brilliantly picked out by sub Alberto Ellis. Yet it was broken hearts as just as Racing had against Trois away, they grabbed a point. But thanks to a horror show from Marco Bizot, the Dutchman at fault, not using his hands on that occasion. He did use his feet to better against the very young and fresh Remy Labo Lascari. Frustration for Seco Fofana and co. Press earning a valuable point, but maybe wondering what could have been.